Hey you guys, so I'm here with my weekly mail. Not too much mail, but I All right, first thing that I got here, this is a camera bag for like one of those um, Polaroid kind of, um, I don't know, like a Polaroid kind of camera. Those, I don't know what they're called. I forget what they're called. Anyway, so when I was offered this bag, I couldn't say no because number one, look how cute it is. It's got two zippers, two big zippers, one on each side. You can see right there and right there. And it's just super cute. I love this baby blue with the tan. It's so pretty. The inside is a very soft felt for your camera. But personally for me, I didn't want it for a camera. I wanted it for like a little, a little bag because I think it's super cute. And my daughter is trying to steal it from me. So anyway, it's got a little tiny zipper right here for little tiny things. Because if you do open the bag all the way, it does open up all the way here. So, you know, you can open it like this or whatever but I thought it was really cute and it has the strap on the inside so you can wear it over the shoulder or cross body or whatever you want so I really like this bag it's adorable and then I got this box here from Pacifica I don't know how I got it I don't know um, I really don't know how I got it to be honest if I entered a giveaway I don't know if I entered a giveaway but there was no like paperwork on the inside to kind of tell me anything um, but on the inside here it is a I guess it's a new um, it's called super kale juiced up shampoo conditioner and then this is a leave on detangling conditioner so I thought that was cute huh they have the cutest packaging Pacifica I love their stuff the way they package everything you never want to throw their packages away but when I do open this, I know who I'm going to keep this little package for. My little friend here that um, I collect cute things for. So that'll be in her little box when I finally send it to her. But this is a definitely a, a keeper kind of a box because it's a nice, hard, firm box. And um, I love cutesy things like this. So that was Pacifica. Then I have, um, I have a beauty box. I have a beauty box from uh, Pinch Me. So actually I'm gonna do a separate video on this because um, they did send me this to kind of share all about Pinch Me and everything. So I'm gonna be doing a separate video on that. So check out the Pinch Me video that's gonna be coming up very, very soon. Maybe today as well. I might put both of these videos up today because it's kind of to share the word about Pinch Me Tuesday, which is coming up this Tuesday. And then I got a beautiful package for, now the package wasn't beautiful, but an amazing package, that's what I should have said, um, from Clinique. So to kind of share, they have um, a new line which came out in February. It's called um, Clinique Pop Artistry. I think it is, yes, Pop Artistry. So they sent me a bunch of these lip colors. There's um, like lip balm lipsticks, and then there's um, tints, and then there's like this pop oil, which is for your cheek and your lips. Um, and they're, they're really pretty. They're just like these bold, vibrant kind of, um, colors. And, um, then this one is super cute. I'll show you this one. This is, um, they're called pot sugar scrubs. They look like little tiny macaroons. Aren't they adorable? And, um, one side is a lip balm and the other side is a lip scrub. It's super cute. So you just unscrew it and that's what that is over there. Um, I really love these. These are adorable. So... I haven't tried any of these things out because I just got them in the mail. So um, I'll be doing like an introduction kind of a video for that. Um, it'll definitely be up on my blog. So, um, you know, I'll go ahead and be very detailed on my blog because I'll be testing them out and trying them and, and everything. Um, and then it also came with an eye cream, which this thing is, is neat. It's, if you see the little container here, that little ball thing, you pop it open and then you can apply it to your eyes. It's supposed to like really help within a few minutes i think it says okay and the last thing that i got here was from ulta and um i don't know i just uh, the peanut butter and jelly palette came out i can't wait for the peach palette to come out i'm i'm definitely gonna get that one um but anyway so let me kind of show you i'm gonna do a separate video on this particular thing with swatches and everything this is the new double duty beauty um i think it's a lip and cheek palette double duty beauty eye and cheek palette did i say lip because that's not what i meant if that's what i said half the time i don't even know what i say anyway so it just looks like this really pretty so i can't wait to show you guys swatches of what it looks like and everything 
but it's it's really really cute I love that they had um, two types this one is the classic courage and the other one was like more cool tone it had like silvers and stuff like that which that's not my thing and on the outside here it says she dreamed she believed and she succeeded I love that okay and then on the website when I made this purchase Oh, and by the way, you guys, don't forget to use Ebates when you're buying anything online because so you can get some cash back. Um, they had a deal with when you buy two, you get one item free from L'Oreal. So I did get two of the number 104. I'm telling you, I love this stuff. I wear this stuff every day. Um, and then I got the L'Oreal Infallible um, Makeup Extender Spray. So I use this every day. I use this every day. I really love it. I, I like it. I like it a lot. And then I got a new Tarte Amazonian Clay Full Coverage Foundation. This one is in the shade Light Medium Sand, and it says it was for light to medium skin tones with yellow undertones, but um, it's really, really light for my skin tone. I'll show you like a little swatch of it. Let me just drop it. I'm going to return it and exchange it for another shade. I have an, a darker one, but it's too dark, and then this one is really too light, and I don't have that much of the other one left. so. Let me show you what this one looks like. So I really like this foundation. I just can't seem to get a shade that works for me right now. Um, I had gotten this other one, I think it, if it was not this past summer, the summer before. And I think I'm a little bit closer to the camera. Zoom me back out. Um, so that other one worked for me when I got it because I had gotten a lot more color in the summer. Um, but yeah, I think I'm going to exchange this one and get a, another shade that is more suiting for me. Next, I loved my other Stila Stay All Day uh, Liquid Lipstick, so I did get another one. Um, this one is in the color Patina. This one is like a really popular shade. If you look up th this particular lipstick, you'll see like Patina all over the place. So it just looks like this and um, it's actually what I'm wearing on my lips right now. So I really like this. These things stay all day long. Um, by the end of the day, I might have some color that comes off right on the inside of the lip, um, but it's there all day, all night. I This is awesome. I wanna get like every shade that pertains to me from there. But these are like $22, I wanna say, something like that. Um, so I can't just like go out and buy a whole bunch of them. So I wait for like little coupons to go through and then I can use it. Um, but anyway, so I really love that. And this is the packaging on that. Again, this is a Stila Stay All Day Liquid Lipstick. So awesome. And I don't find it overly dries my lips either. Next, I got this Tarte Smooth Operator Finishing Powder. This was like a freebie for buying the Tarte products. Um, I do have another one. I haven't really used it. It's a little bit smaller than this particular one, um, so I don't really have an opinion on it. But I'm glad to have another one, so hopefully the other that one is good. I, I have to try it out still. And then the last thing I got, which is the main thing of why I made this purchase, was the peanut butter and jelly palette. And I love this packaging. It's just a happy little toast, kind of looks like a toast, but it's peanut butter and jelly. So peanut butter and jelly lips, it's a happy one. And here is the palette. It's really pure, pretty, pretty, pretty. And um, I don't know, I just, when I saw it, I really, really, really wanted it. So, and I've seen such amazing reviews and I couldn't say no. And the colors in there are my kind of colors. So I'll give you a quick close up of this one. Super cute, isn't it? So you open it up and um, there is, the mirror is behind this little thing here. And these are the shades, just stunning. So there's tons of swatches and things of that sort and tutorials all over the internet on this thing. Um, but I couldn't wait to have, oh, does it smell like the other? It smells a little bit different than the regular chocolate bars. It's, I don't know, I guess, is that supposed to be like a peanut buttery kind of scent? But it's not, it almost smells like, like hot chocolate. The other ones smell like chocolate, but this kind of smells like like powdered hot chocolate. I don't know. I feel like I need to go get my other palette to kind of compare. <laughs> All right, oh, the mirror is super cute. It says Too Faced Peanut Butter and Jelly. And then um, you see right there, let me, you see how it says it right there on the bottom? That's cute, huh? 
And then inside this little thing, it says it's peanut butter jelly time, XOXO. And when you open this little thingy here, it just has a couple of eye looks, which they often do that. So here are a couple of eye looks that they have here and then how to do it on the back side. I haven't swatched it and I haven't touched it or anything like that, but I'm dying to get my fingers into it. So I'm just gonna go right through the center row right here because I just can't. Oh my gosh, that's so pretty. Let's see. Oh my gosh. I'm gonna do all of them and then give you a close up. Those are so pretty. Are they not so, so pretty? I love that. Pretty. So now that I've swatched them, I know that they're all just really, really beautiful, kind of um, very warm tone palette. I love all these shimmery golden colors and stuff like that. Um, probably that jelly and the jammin, those two, the two purple shades, I probably won't use too much. Jammin I may use, um, but everything else, except for this extra creamy white color, I don't understand that in this palette. I guess that's supposed to be the bread, but they should have called it bread. <laughs> All right, and then I got a few samples. My my thing came in um, separate boxes. I didn't get everything all at once. So I got two sets of samples. I got two of these Benefit Professionals, which I love these. These are awesome. I got the Dart Daisy Marc Jacobs um, sample scent. Um, this is Jimmy Choo Illicit and Man. And then we have this B5, I don't know, moisture and vitamin shampoo and conditioner here and a Smashbox primer. I'm definitely gonna be doing a separate swatch video on this double duty um, eye and cheek palette because I haven't seen very many of them, so I figured I'd go ahead and do one. And um, yep, that is it. Thank you guys so very much for watching and I will see you again in another video. Bye.